Good day, friends. Welcome to Smart Bukai. Here's the third problem on under Coulomb's law. The question says that two equally charged pit balls well, are three centimeters apart, which is this, are three centimeters apart in air and repel each other with a force of 4 times 10 raised to the power of negative 5 newton. Compute the charge on each ball. So simply, that simply means that they both repel each other. Right? So it has to be what? Like charges. So the thing we need to do here is that let's solve this and see how we can go about solving this. So what we need to do here is that we bring out the given. So F, which is the Newton, is 4 times 10 to the power of negative 5 Newton, right? And the distance between them is R equals to 6 centimeter. But we have to convert this R equal to 3 centimeter to meter. That will be what? R equal 3 times 10 to the power of negative 2 meter. So in that case, we also know that F, which is the Newton, equals K, Q1, Q2 over R squared. But in this case, Q1 equals to Q2 equals to Q, right? So all we just need to do is say F equal to K times Q divided by R squared. Then, let's substitute for that. F, which is having the value of 4 times 10 to the power of negative 5, right? It is 4 times 10 to the power of negative 5 equals K, which is 9 times 10 to the power of 9, right? Times Q, right? Which is Q1 times Q2, right? Divided by R squared, which is of the value 3 times 10 to the power of negative 2 meter. 3 times 10 to the power of negative 2. Right? This Q here has to be squared. Because it is Q equals to Q2. So each of them is Q. Then definitely Q times Q has to be Q squared. So we need to say that 4 times 10 to the power of negative 5 equals 9 times 10 to the power of 9. Right? Times Q squared all divided by 3 times 10 to the power of negative 2. Remember, we have to square it. So, we can say 4 times 10 to the power of negative 5 equals 9 times 10 to the power of 9 times Q squared divided by 9 if we if we take 3 squared times 10 to the power of negative 4 because minus 2 times 2 is negative 4 so keep simplifying and say this 9 cancel this 9 we are left with what 4 times 10 to the power of negative 5 which equals 10 to the power of 9 times q squared divided by 10 to the power of negative 4 so in that case 4 times 10 to the power of negative 5 equals 10 to the power of 9 plus 4 times q squared, right? So that yields us 4 times 10 to the power of negative 5, which equals 10 to the power of 13 q squared. You have to divide both sides by 10 to the power of 13. So definitely, Q squared will equal 4 times 10 to the power of negative 5 minus 13, which is equal to 4 times 10 to the power of negative 18. So, Q, Q now equals to the square root or 4 times 10 to the power of negative 18, which is the same as Q being 
cube being 2 times 10 to the power of negative 9 Coulomb but there's something left we need to put a sign that shows that the two point charges can be what positive positive or negative negative so here's the final answer goodbye